4 News at 12.30. Welcome back. We have Chef Serge joining us again today. He's cooking up a Moroccan meatball. With What's harissa the, sauce. But, but is there like another it's, word? It's a tagine. 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 That's what wow. I was, we were talking about the clay pot. That, that's what it is. And unfortunately, like I said, gravity and clay pots don't, <laughs> you know, are I not know. friends. <laughs> and uh, I broke mine. Um, what we're going to start with is well, I want to talk to you, to you about the harissa. Harissa okay. is, uh, is the pepper paste sauce that is very, very... Um, uh, very fruity at the same time, and does it's very it, spicy. Okay. It does have a, quite a bit of kick. Nice. And one of the things that you obviously we can make them, but the most important thing is 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 the way the peppers are, are grown in in that area. So mm -hmm. if you buy it store bought, I think it's completely Where acceptable. Where can you get it at the store? You can get it at any specialty stores. You, you know, any specialty stores, uh, Mediterranean stores, Middle Eastern stores, even Asian stores do have those. Okay. But one of the uh, what I wanted to talk to you about first of all the meatballs, yes. uh, ground beef. I put a little bit of uh, uh, onions in there, a little bit of cumin, some cinnamon, uh, a little bit of uh, uh, pepper. Uh, Is that already mixed in it's there? It's already mixed in, ready to go. There you go. And uh, some cilantro. What I did, make uh, meatballs out of them. After that, I fried them in this pan. Once I fried them, I used the same pan, which it's got I'm gonna all go the on this side. You so want to go on this yeah. side? Yeah, there we I'm go. I'm going to show them this. There you go. And once I so did that, I went ahead and put your onions and garlic, they're already yeah. still sautéed. Then, uh, once again, use fresh ingredients when you can. Fresh tomatoes. That's Man, the key. They are amazing. The, the tomatoes this time of year are very amazing. And paprika. Talk about a lot of spices. Uh, a little bit of, uh, that, that was uh, cumin. That's what gives it all the flavor. And, yes, it does. A little bit of salt. I got mm, just a little bit of uh, uh, mints right here. And don't forget your harissa sauce. Harissa sauce, okay. Harissa sauce. It looks is spicy. Really, it really is, <laughs> but it's delicious. If you want to take a spoon and taste it, it's quite all right. You can you can enjoy it, but you mix yeah. all your spices in there. Okay. And once you do, you go ahead and uh, add your meatballs. You never, you know, looking at this, you never would have guessed that there'd be tomato chunks in it. It is fresh tomatoes in there. And yeah. we just, not in the meatballs. Oh, itself. I'm sorry. No, no, no. That's in the sauce. Oh, itself. that's the sauce. Okay. Yes. Once we did the meatballs, we, well, all I did was pan fry the meatballs and uh, made a ball and used. Oh my uh, goodness, it smells so good. It really you can just is. really you can smell, smell like the, all the those flavor. good flavors, cumin. You can smell. You, you smell the harissa, which is very, very um, fragrant. Yeah. That's the word I'm looking for. Then you add, you put the meatballs in there. You cook it for about 10 minutes. You get some uh, chickpeas in chickpeas there. Chickpeas in there. A little very. And then rich on the side, you want to like um, grill up. Uh, Oh, no, actually, no. put it all together. All in there. All in there. You, like I said, you're making a pretty much a stew. You put it in there. You stir it That's up. That's so 25, convenient. 25, 30 Save minutes later. Save all these later, dishes. 25, 30 minutes later, this is going to be an amazing dish. So you mix the, it all up, and this is what it's going right to look like there. right here. Yes. Oh, and you can see some juices in there, too, which is good. It's like and a looks stew. like I forgot to put the mint in the, uh, in the sauce itself. Let's go ahead and put that in there, and we are ready to go. All right. 25 minutes, that's all it's going to take. And again, you can head to our website. We'll have that um, recipe on there. Chef Serge, always great having you on the show. Thanks so much. Thank Definitely you for have to me. try these out. Really simple to make here. All right, we're going to have Dialing for Dollars with Pat after the break. Don't go anywhere.